Welcome to our YouTube channel. This video, we'll be discussing an unsettling and potentially criminal case out of San Francisco. A former San Francisco Fire Commissioner, Don Carmignani, has been accused of being potentially involved with eight assaults using bear spray, which is a more powerful type of pepper spray, against unhoused people in the city. Carmignani was originally the victim of a publicized incident where he had claimed he was attacked by an unhoused man with a metal rod and had suffered a fractured skull. The San Francisco Public Defender's Office, however, said in a statement that evidence may link Carmignani to the eight unsolved assaults. Video, turned over to the office by the prosecution, showed Carmignani with pepper spray in his hand as he approached the unhoused man. A witness told police that she heard Carmignani threaten to stab and kill the unhoused man if he didn't leave. The prosecution has also turned over evidence for eight attacks between November 2021 and 2023, where a man matching Carmignani's description approaches unhoused people and sprays them with pepper spray or bear spray. In one incident, the attacker attacked an unhoused man and woman with bear spray and then took the woman's wallet, cell phone and earrings and even threw to the ground a dog that belonged to one of the victims. The San Francisco District Attorney, Brooke Jenkins, said at a press conference that police had not presented a case against Carmignani regarding the attacks but she also said that charges were still in place against the unhoused man who was accused of assaulting Carmignani. She stated that the charges required testimony from Carmignani as the victim and that he had not yet provided an interview to police despite multiple requests. The whole story is certainly concerning. The idea of someone attacking others, especially unhoused individuals, is atrocious. It's important to remember that these are only allegations and nothing has been proven yet. We hope the truth comes out and that justice is served to the individuals involved in this case.